Hello everyone, this is Gene. I'm using RJ to stand in for me uh, right now, mainly because I'm very tired. So anyway, um, I just wanted to give just an update. Um, so as I've said in other videos, the videos are going to be sporadic because I is busy. <laughs> and RJ is apparently sneezy. Good boy. Good. Stop it. Good boy. Yeah. <laughs> But anyway, and he's apparently taking a bath right on camera. He has no shame. But anyway, um, I just wanted to just give an update. I'm not dead yet. The channel's not abandoned. I'm just very, very, very busy and very, very, very tired. So um, I have content coming up once I can find the energy to get back to work on it. <laughs> and um, I believe I was asked by a commenter. Unfortunately, the person's name escapes me. I apologize. But they would like my opinion on She-Hulk, so I will be giving my opinion on She-Hulk and the lady who was cast as She-Hulk. Although I must say that I'm wondering, I'm wondering more how they're going to approach She-Hulk and Jen Walters, because they're not really the same person, right? Jennifer Walters is, is an entirely different person and personality than She-Hulk typically is. Even in the... Even in the modern Jason Aaron stories, which I am not a fan of and I've made videos about, right? She-Hulk is not the same as Jen Walters. She-Hulk is meant to be a manifestation of everything uh, Jen wants to be, right? At least that was the way she was when she was written by John Byrne. And that's what most people held to, uh, at least up until Jason Aaron got his, uh, his hands on the character. But anyway, like I said, I have many opinions. I just need the energy to actually work on on the videos. So I'll be back around at some point, right? When I come around. Anyway, I hope everyone is well. If you're not doing well, I hope uh, things improve for you. I will see you all around soon. I don't know when exactly, but soon. All right. Have a good day or night. Stay safe. See you around. Bye. <laughs>